Hello, hello, hello everybody, welcome back in the Hermitcraft stream weekend, of course, is what it is, uh, I believe that, oh, of course, <laughs> so of course, Doc is like, let's get going, so um, I need to meet him in the shopping uh, district, I'm really glad that he told me that, like, you know, before we're actually meeting, but, uh, but no, apparently we're meeting there right now, <laughs> so I'm running, <laughs> running to the portal right this second, oh my goodness. Oh, man, I'm in a rush now. I'm in a rush. So we need to go through here and then we need to find the shopping district. Oh, man, I think he's this way. Here he is. I mean, he knows I'm uh, here, right? <laughs> what is he doing? Nah, man. Yeah, there's no face cam today. Sorry, guys. Um, what? I don't know what's meant to be. Explode one and pass it on. <laughs> okay, thanks. You sneaky, sneaky, sneaky man, you. Okay. False hype. False hype. <laughs> false hype. False hype. False hype. False hype. False hype. Thank you very much, my dude. Uh, intra. Thank you very much. For the uh, 500 biddies before I've even started. Thank you, thank you. Also, Mama just fell from a high place, which sounds terrible, actually, because I think I know where where they are. Um, or well, where Mama is, I should say. Um, they might be in a different dimension. <laughs> which is not a good one to die in, is it really? So, oh dear, oh dear. Sounds fun. Anyway, anyway, uh, I am probably gonna chuck this stuff in a chest because my goodness, carrying around with me sounds like an awful idea. But we've got Stream Weekend 3 Stew. <laughs> uh, okay, and some TNT. Sure, why not? Anyway, welcome readers. Hello, hello, hello. How is everyone doing today? Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Man, you guys. How are we all doing today? Echo Ace coming in with the 314 bits. Happy Pi Day. Ah, oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. I didn't realize that. Actually, no, I think I saw that on Twitter earlier today. But it's, it's not Pi for, yeah, for us Brits. Because we write the date correctly. Uh, unlike uh, <clears throat> other people. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, so, yeah. But thank you very much for that. I appreciate that. I actually just still had a doc stream up for some reason. There we go. It's gone. Uh, but thank you, Doc, for the raid. Uh, we are going to be doing some of the Hermitcraft stuffs. I'm going to be catching up with you guys' uh, little um, things now and again. The bits and the subs and all the things. So bear with me on that. Um, I don't even know what... I haven't even decided what I'm going to do first today. There's actually a whole bunch of things I want to do. One thing is actually uh, a little bit of gathering. So actually, you know what? While I'm reading your biddies and alerts and everything, maybe we'll hop on uh, over to... Oh no, do I really not have a shovel that's not broken? Huh. Dang, dude, how do we fix this shovel? Man, I didn't realise that. Okay, you know what, we'll do villagers first then. Because <laughs> if we get like an efficiency uh, book, that might work. We might be able to make a new shovel. Anyway. Yeah, I need levels. I don't have an XP farm, okay? Um, but we'll do that at some point. I'm using iron tools just because I have them. Uh, and they're not breaking. Well, they are breaking, but they're replaceable, right? Whereas, um, because I don't have, like, an XP farm or know of one that's really easy to get to, I'm just sort of doing it this way for now. If that's if that's cool with everybody, uh, we're just doing it this way for now. But at some point soon, I will start using diamond tools and everything. What have we done? Hype train is a-rolling. What we... What happened? What level are we at? What? Wait, what? I've just looked at it and now it's not saying anything. Oh, level two complete. My goodness. Okay, I have missed everything completely. But thank you guys. I'll go back through the biddies and all the stuff in just a second. Uh, I want to grab, I think, lecterns and we want to hop in the uh, hop in the little villager hole over here for a bit and uh, see if we can get ourselves. Oh, there's actually quite a lot of guys in here. <laughs> um, I may have done some breeding. Um, didn't realise there were quite so many. I think I've been AFK and all the babies have grown up is what's happened. Um, so we sh should be able to work with villagers for a little bit. I need to get... What is it? Looting 3 still? We'll see if we can get a Looting 3 guy in here. That would be great. Uh, do I have my minecart and stuff? I don't in here. 
Let's go grab that and then we'll be good. But anyway, thank you very much to BR Sweets with the two month reserve. We've got Lee Gold with the 200 biddies. We've got Leon with the 100 biddies. Extinct Rex with 42 months. My goodness. It's snowing outside for you. Is it really? That's kind of crazy, actually. Uh, I don't think we've had any hint of snow um, in the UK, at least. Right, now, where did I put the tracks? Wait, no, come on. I must have put the tracks in one of those. That makes no sense otherwise. Where did the tracks go? Tracks? Hello? Minecart? Is minecart in there? What did I do with them, guys? Anyone? Did anyone see them? Did anyone see them anywhere? Don't want to open every single chest. There's those. Oh, they're there. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm, I am blind. My bad. I found it. I found it. But yeah, no face cam today, which is, is I, I guess, rare for my streams. Yes, uh, I didn't fancy it. My my allergies at the, today are just um, a nightmare. So I'm just gonna keep 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 it off because I might as well. I can't I can't be fussed with the nonsense of a face cam today. <laughs> I have given up. Face cam face cam is not happening. Uh, maybe tomorrow. We'll see. Um. Anyway, we've got our 100 biddies from Lee Peter. Thank you very much. I missed your cheer. I'm sorry. I, well, I didn't miss it, but I just haven't read it out yet. Uh, Q Quake, thank you for the 45 months. Emergency with the 100 biddies. Doc had a lot of tracks in his stream. He did indeed. I think I caught a little bit of his stream, and I think I, I think I get what you're going going for there with the tracks. Um, there's a lot of uh, gifted subs happening, guys. Thank you so much for the gifted subs. We are, of course, trying to get to our sub goal of 750. I don't think we'll get it today at all, but if we do, that would be kind of incredible. Uh, so thank you very much for all the subs and gift subs. Right, uh, you guys really want to jump in this hole, don't you? Just, who wants to volunteer? You? Go on then. Go on then. You're pushing it. You don't, no, you're not meant to push it. That's not how, that's not how it works. Okay, I'll leave you there. I should have grabbed the other one. Oh no, wait, wait, wait. Wait, aha! Ha ha, we has one. We has one. Thank you very much for the 50 biddies there. Um, and secondhand candy with the five gifted subs. My my dude, thank you very much for that. I appreciate that a lot. Right, let's get uh, the same setup as we had last time where we had the, uh, the slabs, I think, worked pretty well last time. So if we do this again, F3B, we, no, watch out, dude. Oh, one accidentally hit you, okay? Ow, that guy hurt himself, I think. Oh, that's because I didn't figure out what was above his head first. Oopsie. Oopsie. Uh, how do I want to do this? I guess. Let's chuck the lectern there first. Put this block back. Yeah, you'll be fine. Okay, you're in there already. Goody. Good, good. Um, right, I guess uh, we need to... Oh, that's what I need to go get. I need to go get the, uh, <laughs> the minecart back. I knew there was some reason that, why I made it so that I could like crawl into here. There we go. Aha! I remember what I was up to last time. I remember exactly what I was up to. There you go. That works better. Much better. Coolly cool. Right, next up. Come on, man. Line up, line up. Jump in the queue. Uh, Dib, thank you very much for gifting four tier one subs. I appreciate that. Let me scroll down and get some of the other names. Uh, we had Echo Ace with the gifted five subs as well. Chess Knight with the tier one. We've got Hades with the 100 biddies, of course. Um, thank you very much. Uh, Dax with the 100 biddies. Respawn 2 with the six months. Senna with the 100 biddies. Leon with the 100 biddies. Uh, five, two, gifted a tier one sub to Blaster. Thank you very much for the gifted sub. Appreciate that. We've got Lucky with the 29 months in a row. Come on, guys. Line up. That's it. Go. Go. Run that way. Towards the minecart. In fact, I should probably bring the minecart that way. There we go. Aha. Ha-ha. Get in that. Get down in that little, uh, little spot there. Boom. Uh, so I need to probably get rid of that block this time. That would be a smart idea, I think. And then if we get... No, it's not that one, is it? It's this one? Yeah, okay. And then we need to break you, and then we need to break you, and then we need to break, oh, place that there. Ha ha ha. And then I'm just going to chuck a block there for now, actually. Because I think we're not really quite sure exactly what we're going to be turning these guys into. But there we go. Right. Number two. Do I have any more slots? I actually don't have any more slots. Okay. That makes it a little bit more challenging with the rest of the guys. But I guess we'll leave them here. They can hang out, right? Um... 
potentially spawn some cats, maybe, in the area. That could be kind of cool. That could be kind of cool. Who has phantoms? Uh, no one, necessarily. Um, the, uh, the bit noise is, I think, phantom noises. It is the alerts. <laughs> I think it'd be really weird if they, they were just constantly making that exact noise. Um, phantoms always make the, the, the way scarier noise first, I think. That, like, really screechy noise. I'm not sure what to call it. Uh, I can't place... Hmm. One moment. Let me place a block there. Place you there. Place you there. There you go. Is that better for you? Piercing. We don't want piercing. But we do want this guy to be something cool. So let's hope we get some luck here. I'm looking for looting three, but efficiency three is also pretty good. So let's let's get some luck rolling in the chat so we can uh, hopefully get this uh, going pretty well. Quick charge, we do not need that right now. Uh, who else did I miss? Lucky with the 29 months in a row. Thank you very much for the 29 months. Arian smile with the 1500 biddies. My goodness, thank you very much. Uh, DSOS, thank you very much for the 100 biddies. Appreciate that. Um, and Ace with the 100 biddies. They're the guys I missed earlier. Thank you for that. Sounds big head as well with the 17 months in a row. Loyalty too. I don't want that. I don't want the things I want. Blast protection. No, not right now. Uh, Kikor as well with the 100 biddies. Surfer with the tier 1 sub. Thank you very much for the tier 1. Uh, and UI with the uh, prime as well. I'm missing my uh, my things here. Here we go. And Peter Pan with the 100 biddies. And Tarsiris with the 300. There you go. I think I've actually caught up for once. I'm breaking three, if only. 38 emeralds, nah, 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 mate. I think I got cheaper over the other side. <laughs> not, not right now, not right now. Depths Rider, not right now. Soon, but not right now. I'm trying to get like all the villagers going because at this point, I can pretty much get myself geared up. Oh, which is very, very cool. Must be a fisherman villager. What, the style of this guy? Yeah, I think this guy bred with one of the other guys over there. And of course, looks like that which I think is pretty fancy now these guys no they came from a, a desert village I think this is a stubborn one now nah, they're all stubborn all villages are stubborn oh infinity for 15 oh that's really tempting okay infinity for 15 that might be a good shout actually I don't think I have infinity do I I don't think so oh you need 15 emeralds really okay fine he might change it by the time I do that then. Apparently I, I've literally used all my emeralds. My bad, can I? <laughs> just squeeze past you, just squeeze past you, it's fine. <laughs> oh, that's fine, Infinity will come back up again if we're, he loses that. But yeah, actually, yeah, let's grab these over here. It's not really worth it, okay, fair enough. But we'll leave that guy doing that then. And we'll grab some of these guys instead. Out for my doors. My doors seem pretty fine right now. I'm good. But thanks for being concerned. My doors appreciate it. <laughs> oh. Keep it. I'm gonna sell other things. I'm gonna sell uh, the paper right now and the carrots and the wheat. Uh, that should give us more than enough emeralds to get whatever trades we get. And then, um, yeah, I do. I do kind of want to get some villagers that are like not. Um, with the lectern or the or farmers or what the other guys that we have I don't know I've basically got three different types of villages in there at the moment I want to start sort of um I guess getting some different kinds which I think would be really good I've also had a thing about doors sitting the wrong way yeah he changed mine and then I changed it back and then he told me why and then I changed it back to his way again <laughs> <laughs> so my door, my front door on my little hobbit hole over there should be pretty good. Should be fine. You think I have infinity? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. I think it was silk perch I was thinking of. Did I did that all drop? Okay. Let's pick it all back up. I need to make the... I think I might. I don't know. I wasn't sure about doing like a zero tick farm, but now I'm like... Oh, everyone's making zero tick sugarcane farm farms, guys. Do you think I should make one as well? Not right now, because I'm not actually sure how they work, but I don't know. Do we just do it that way instead? I am going to be building over here at some point, so I pro I do need to move the sugarcane at some point soon. 
because I'm only working around the edges. In fact, I, I added a marker. There you go. That's a corner. Look at that. I did that when Doc was streaming over there. <laughs> I added a marker for a corner. A corner. That's the first, first bit of my base being built, guys. A corner. Look at it. Isn't it incredible? It's going to be amazing. <laughs> Little piston door. Why do I need a piston door? I think my, my wooden door is just fine. Need an automatic sugarcane farm? Yeah, I think we'll go for an automatic sugarcane farm at some point. The problem is, what what I didn't realise would happen this season is that I just... All I want to build is farms. I just want everything farmed. Oh, I mean, there are going to be things I'm going to have to, like, buy from other people, but... But at the same time, I'm like, man, I could just get, like, farms going, <laughs> you know? And, like, get a lot of things for myself. I'm really, really 100% just so happy that I did villagers, because villagers have saved me an awful lot. Um, and they're gonna be great. Um, and I think... Previously we've done creep farm, and that was pretty great last season. But I don't mind buying rockets, they shouldn't get too expensive. Um, but it's, it's the really expensive stuff that is really easy to get, like villagers, that I don't want to pay for this season. <laughs> I'm, get, I'm cheap this season, okay? I'm cheap. I am cheap. That's how I am. Uh, AFK fishing, I'm not even going to bother with it. Why, why, what is the point of AFK fishing other than, like, name tags, I guess, right? Because I've got villagers, so I've already got mending going. So I don't know what other reason they would need AFK fishing. What other, what other reasons are there? Oh, no, it's raining. It's raining. The heck? Since when does it rain in Minecraft? Come on! I don't like the rain. Actually, no, I do quite like the rain. Although, <laughs> although stamping all over all these wet crops probably isn't great. I'm glad, I, I'm hoping I've got my wellies on. You can get name tags from villagers as well. Exactly, that's what I mean. Like, villagers solve all the issues of AFK fish farms. So, like, why, it's like, so, shells for conduit. But can't you get, oh, I guess the only way of getting those is from a drowned, right? But isn't, like, a drowned farm, like, gonna be good for that? You think? I don't know. So whoever has a uh, drown farm will just be like, I don't know, able to do that. So I, yeah, like, I don't know. So I'm not really sure. Oh man, it's really dark out here. I need to actually probably get inside or sleep or something. Because uh, my base looks really friendly over this side, but over that side, oh man, it's not. It's not good. Do I do need this? No, I'll come back out for the sugar game in a second. Whew. If in the chat for the wheat, yes, indeed. The poor wheat. Also, if you missed the last stream, by the way, we got cats finally. So I'm going to be breeding these guys up while we're while we're over here. I don't know how many I'm going to need yet. I haven't I haven't yet looked at the creep farm design that I might want to make. Um, but let's just breed up. Actually, maybe let's just breed up two more. Two more baby cats. Come on then. No, 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 don't, no, what are, you do, what are you doing? You didn't do that before, you meant to have the babbies. We need the babby. Oh, just because I put this chest down it, isn't it? No, <laughs> stop it. No. I've given you both. <sighs> what even is in this chest? Did we put the stream torch or something in here? Right, babbies. Finally, okay, they got they got the message. Right, you sit down over there then. You go over there as well. The baby's gone to the bed, of course it has. Now my inventory's full. Where's the chest? Here it is. Okay, I'm gonna put the chest uh, here. And hope that we don't have the same issue happen again. I think we might do. Right, okay, the baby's over there. Come on, baby, over here. That's it. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. They're too cute. My video bitrate sucks today. It's the same every day. So, uh, it sucks in general. Yes, I, I agree. Um, funnily enough, I don't have control over my internet speeds because uh, I live in the UK and our internet sucks. So, you either have to deal with it or, you know, leave. I'm not right either way, to be honest. Uh, <laughs> um, if it was something I could change, then I'd feel sorry about it. But literally, when you can't change something in life, it's no good being, you know, upset about it. 
it's something I, I guess I've I've taken, you know, pretty literally at the moment. Oh, cat! <laughs> dude. 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 The internet isn't that bad in the UK. I was talking about mine. <laughs> I mean, of course there are going to be people in the UK that have better internet. No, cat, please. Cats are obsessed with doors at the moment. They just keep running towards them. Leashes. I don't need a leash just for this little thing. I'll just push it this way and then we'll be fine. And then they'll grow up. I stole Sandy Cat. No, Sandy Cat's um not that. That's Voldemort over there in the corner. <laughs> I think it was so sad, cat and that cat looks different anyway, aren't they? Different kinds? They're very similar, but they're different kinds. They're not it's not Ren's cat. It would have been named if it was Ren's cat Ren's cat. I'm not I'm not Jevin, okay? I'm not stealing someone's cat. <laughs> That's not happening. Um right, where were we with these guys? I completely forgot. I think we were with you, but you've now got sweeping edge. So yeah, let's get, I guess, um some trades going over here. Uh, I guess you'll see what what's happening with those guys in their next video, I'm sure, so... Ask me about it when I'm literally... I don't have a clue. It's not very helpful. It's not very helpful. I can't be of much help to you guys. Uh, and let's make some paper as well. Oh, I didn't grab the other paper. Oh, what have I got? 23? Uh, let's, yeah, let's go grab the other paper real quick. And then once we're finished with these villages, um, we'll, uh, we'll head on, on another adventure. Uh, who is after me? I believe Impulse is. I think Impulse is the one streaming after I am. But yeah, about the bitrate. The bitrate isn't that bad unless I'm doing... Like, when I start doing this, like, it'll be bad because the pixels on the screen are kind of intense. But, um, when I'm not doing stuff like that, it's not as bad. Swings and roundabouts. Swings and roundabouts. Zombie Cleo's head game. We are going to be, um... I guess spoilers, right? Not that I've recorded the video yet, but I will be taking part in head game. Head games. Of course. I mean, come on now. I feel like it's obvious that I'm going to be taking part in something like that. Wait, no, head game. Wait, no, the head game isn't PvP related, is it? Isn't it just like collecting heads? The Cleo or something? Does any? Can someone give me the lowdown? <laughs> give me the lowdown. I, I might go check it out later, but I'm not going to head over there right right now. PvP is allowed. So are we trying to, is, is the point to get as many different kinds of heads as possible? Or, or like what? I'm not really sure. CT, thank you very much for the tier one sub. Thank you very much, my dude. Uh, appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you for the sub. Zerk has also uh, resubbed for eight months in a row. Jay has also gifted five tier one subs. Thank you very much, Jay. Appreciate those. Uh, Bun Bun with the 100 biddies. You managed with the 100 biddies. Thank you, guys. Um... Where are the paper dudes? There's this guy over here, but there's also a paper guy here. Yeah, you're, you're not a master yet. You need to become a master of your craft. You can PvP or you can trade with the wandering villagers. I have not seen one wandering villager in my area at all this whole season. <laughs> like the whole season. I have not seen one. I think they just don't like me. I've not been able to trade any with anyone. I was really hoping to, like, have a few so that, you know, if I get any doubles, I will, like, sell them to, like, clear or whatever and keep, like, one each myself, but that hasn't happened. Chill on the spam, guys. You don't need to pretend you're a creeper. It's fine. <laughs> Selling stuff in the chat won't help you out very much. Um, right. I guess channeling? No, we don't want you. But now we can actually afford a, um trades so let's see if we can now get this guy on is it looting three looting three or efficiency three this guy is selling heads i'm sure he is everyone will be selling heads to cleo as well as, lo as long as cleo has oh a fit back or i think i've got that yeah exactly the same trade over there but yeah no 100 percent. it'll it'll be a great um a great way of making money i think respiration not not respiration one what's what's the point in that you think there can only be one wandering trader on the server at a time, really? But I've not seen any, though. And I've been on the server when there's, like, a couple other people and when the server's full, you know? Like, doesn't seem to matter. Doesn't seem to matter. A whole, a wholesome Hammercraft stream day, indeed. 
I actually missed uh, everybody else's streams other than Docs, so I, I, I'm literally clueless as to what anyone else got up, up to today. You know where there's multiple wandering villages? I don't. I don't know what the spawning of them uh, is like, honestly. So I don't. I don't know how. Uh... Please, sir. Do you mind? I need some space over here. I don't want to accidentally hit you with my axe. <laughs> that will not be good. Frostwalker? Nah. No one needs Frostwalker. Come on now. Who who in chat actually uses Frostwalker? Come on. Come on. Anyone? No, because no one uses it. <laughs> Frostwalker. Oh, I've got a map. I'm good. I don't, I don't need a map right now, but thank you for offering me the map. Oh, have you frozen now? Oh, dang it. Okay. Uh, only for ice farms. Oh, I guess so. I guess that is a good thing for it, right? Could you make an ice farm and then have like, um, like a le leave a pair of Frostwalker boots over there and then you use them every time you, uh, yeah, I don't know. Right, where's the sun? Yeah, the sun's going down. Okay, fine. We'll uh, grab this bamboo instead then, I think. You can't harvest that ice? That's what I thought, but people people are saying it's for ice farms, so I don't, I don't know. Oh my goodness, sorry about the, the bit rate. <laughs> Pixels are falling all over the screen. How dare they? How very dare they? You used Frostwalker in UHC once, you ended up mostly over water. That's that that's where it's pretty great, to be honest. I'd like I kinda like to do a UHC where like the last circle is like or the area you teleport to at the end is like um an ocean and everyone's got frostwalker boots and you just you're literally just doing that the whole time. You're just running around in frost with frostwalker boots. That could be pretty funny. That could be pretty pretty funny, I think. Um, I'm pretty full on bamboo actually. I'm trying to stay on top of it because uh, I don't want to have to grow any later on when I've actually got like a decent base going. I'm gonna put that there instead. Let's chuck a lot of bamboo over there. That might be a good shout. That'll keep all this other stuff empty. Which will be a good time. Let's grab some more. Man, I've not... Have I really got... Oh, I thought I... Okay, there is quite a lot. Fine. For some reason I thought it would fill up a whole double chest, but it hasn't. Okay, good, good, good. Good, good, good. Right, is it night time yet? No, it's becoming night time though. Um, Psychraft so uses pistons and slide blocks to remove armor stands with boots with Frostwalker. Really? Headshot? Does that work with armor stands? It can't do, surely. That seems so weird. Surely it has to be an actual like person, like with the with the boots on. Aaron, smile! Come on in with the five gifted subs, you guys. My goodness. We're now only a hundred away from the sub goal. You guys are crazy today. Thank you very much for the resubs. Well the and the gifted subs as well. Item transport? I know item transport like pistons work really well, but I've still got this guy over here. <laughs> this, this pirate. Um, sorry, someone just, I don't know, did something in my house. Um, <laughs> you probably heard that noise. Um, I might want to go check that they're okay. I think they're, they should be good. Uh, no face cam, just because my, al my allergies today are just going crazy. My nose, you might be able to tell I sound maybe bunged up. I'm not sure. But yeah, my nose is going crazy. My eyes were going crazy earlier, like really itchy. Um, so I was just like, you know what? I don't want a bright light in my face today <laughs> with um, with the stream. So, so yeah. In fact, I'm gonna leave that in the villager thing. I'm not getting sick. No, no, no. I just I I've had I've had these al this allergy sort of thing for like a few months now, and I don't even know quite what I'm allergic to. But I think I'm allergic to just living at the moment. <laughs> so that's my life at the moment, which is fine. Which is fine. Um, oh, we've got this farmer over here as well. 22 carrots. Is he cheaper than this guy? Nah, 22 carrots as well. Fair enough. Um, 
Nah, it's not poor folks. It's it's you know allergies are allergies. It's it's cool. Um, I took a antihistamine thing before the stream, so I, I should be better. Um. I did say at the beginning of the stream, yeah, but but not everybody is at the beginning of the stream. Do you mind, sir? Sir, get out of the way. No, oh, blimey, okay. Are you getting shoved? No, you're shoving me. Get out. No. No. Behave yourselves. I do have kitties, yeah. There, there's a reason for the kitty cats as well. I'm going to be putting the kitty cats to work pretty soon. Um, Antihistamines can take a few days to take effect. No, 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 not the ones I take. They, uh, <laughs> if I if I wake up um, in the morning and I realize that my, my uh, allergies are gonna get bad, I just take one and then I'm good for the day. <laughs> I just didn't take one until recently, um, right right before the stream. So it didn't quite um didn't quite um start working soon enough. Oh, dude, I need to clock. I need to clock down in here because I cannot tell what time of day it is that these villagers like accept trades again. And I want to be able to uh, to check that. I've got a clock there, but I think I'm gonna make another one. Is this how you make a clock? Have I forgot? Oh, not like that. Like this. Yes. Okay. So if I get one of those and one of these, will be sweet. A creep farm will happen at some point. Does anyone have any cats I need for a creep farm? <laughs> I guess it depends on the scale of it, right? Right, let's put it... Oh, excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Put it there. So that is like... What is that? Three pixels? Have you reset yet? No. So... Does it need to be... Like that? Two pixels. Huh. Weird. So, if he's not, is there, is, there, is there logic to this? I could use a redstone lamp, but what's the point of a redstone lamp when I've got a clock on the wall? So if that's two pixels, does it need to be, he's a cartographer, is he, is he stuck? No, he's not. He's the guy that's, I've just been, uh... yeah, wait, why has he got, oh, is he, is he, why do they use like these random other things? This is why I don't just leave their, uh, their stuff everywhere. That's weird. Okay, fine. Oh, why do they? Uh, that see, that just seems like such a bug to me. See, why is he? Why is he still a cartographer though? Because we were just messing around with him, with trades, and now he's seems stuck. So he's been claimed. He can't claim them. They seem to. That's why I've got like these guys wandering around. These librarians and stuff. <gasps> Feather falling. Not the 24 diamonds, though. Uh, not diamonds, emeralds. He's picked up a cart cartographer table from somewhere. Where are you getting this cartography table from? It's not, there isn't one. It needs to be noon, really? Does this need to be completely blue, then, I guess? I guess we'll figure this out. And then we'll know this for the future. And then I won't have to, like, wait around <laughs> anymore. I'll just know what time things are. Yeah, you're fem falling. We don't want feather falling. You're not ready yet, okay. So now it's noon, right? That's almost noon, if not noon. This guy is still like properly like into his cartography. Get out, get out of here. I don't want to mess around with the villagers like the whole stream, but it, this guy's frustrating. 45 degree angle for the clock. What do you mean? Oh, there we go, definitely noon now. I don't understand. Put dirt in front of him. That won't mean that won't change anything, surely. Don't stop it. Stop staring at me like that. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't have any emoticons that are lot unlockable with points, no, because that doesn't seem possible, I think, on Twitch at the moment, with the way points work. But um I don't know, we'll leave that guy there like that for now. Obviously, it doesn't seem to be working, so we'll just leave it. No looting free for us today. We'll maybe Work come back stations later. Stations don't block their pathfinding, so they try to tie themselves to other stations. You have to put a block in front of them. Okay, thank you, Disturbed Puppy. Um, fair enough. I lost the cartography table. It's fine. I can make another one. Uh, I was gonna try and get some other villagers going, but seeing as though um, 
we're not having much luck with them. I think we'll we'll leave that another time. Um, I also want to go uh, spawner hunting, actually. Uh, that's another thing I wanted to do on stream, was find a spawner. There's apparently a spawner that I've been told about. Um, that is... Well, there's, there's apparently one, like, down by my zombie spawner. And apparently there's one, like, over there somewhere that's really close to the surface. So we might go try and find those. Um, so we can light them up, actually. That might be a good shout. Take torches with us. Because I really want to... Like, I want a better farm. A uh, zombie farm, whatever it is. Maybe potentially an X XP farm, I don't really know. But I don't know if that one, the one I have there, the basic one, is the best option for us with our main base. So I'm gonna... I've got some coordinates here, I think. Where are the coordinates? There they are, okay. Um, so yeah, I think... You know what, let's, let's go via the... via the, uh, the zombie farm we have. JT and Bex, thank you very much for the tier one sub. How are you guys? How are you guys doing? Thank you for the uh, the sub. I appreciate it. Congrats, by by the way, on your um raising money and all that good stuff. Seems to go pretty well. Why are you holding on to stuff? Stop it. You're not allowed to. I need to put a light in the spawner as well at some point. So I think if I look at the uh, coordinates. 295. Yeah, it's like pretty much. This might be a bad way to go. I don't know. We're probably going to come across the spawner. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, let's have a look at the spawner. Hi. Talk about basic room, right? Um, so, what we should do is probably do that. Go around the spawner. Nope, that didn't go around the spawner. Go right around the spawner. See if we can find this other one. Uh, the other one is, uh, actually the other one's, other one's higher up. You know what we might be better off doing? Is like just digging straight down. That might be a better shout. Or taking this actually, this might be a good shout. Yeah, this is a perfect shout in fact. Um, cool, let's, let's use this cave. It must be close then if it's sort of near this cave. So it is 9-5. Okay, yeah, 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 it should be this way. I don't think I've found this spawner yet. But it apparently it exists. Let's hope these coordinates are correct. I do already have an elytra, you are correct, I do. I just have not... Oh, it's right here, that was a bit fast, I didn't realise it was um right here. Hi, I didn't bring a shield with me. Uh... <laughs> <gasps> Oopsie. No. <gasps> oh, we could get... Oh, we can have a skeleton spawner, though, dudes. Oh! Oh, it's really bad down there. Okay, no, no, no. Dude. This is nice. Oh, hello. Stuff as well. I'll take it. In fact, I'm going to take it all. Dude, I love a good skeleton spawner. I wish, dude. Literally, if you look at how close this is to my zombie one, like, it's about, like, 30, 40 blocks away from each other. And, yeah, I literally didn't find the, the, the skeleton one. That would have been way worth um, grabbing instead of the zombie, I think. But, hey, we've found both now. We've got a zombie spawner already set up. We can get a skeleton one, too. The skeleton one, I really want to set up mostly for um, arrows, I think. Because I never had last season a actual um, good uh, thing for arrows, did I? So that is going to be really great. Could even sell arrows. That could be kind of nice. I don't know if... Um, and bows and things, perhaps. If I get some good loot from those guys. I don't know. Yeah, that's not spam, guys. I, I can read the chat uh, without having to, <laughs> having to repeat things a million times. Is I don't think it's a duo spawner, Damien. They don't. They're not close enough. I don't think. Um. I don't know if those um minecart spawners are worth it. You know, when you sit in a minecart and you like say one spawner's there, one spawner's there, and you get a minecart and you go around on a track. I don't think that's worth it, is it? Scar just summoned the wither. 
No, he got a wither skeleton skull. How dare he get a wither skeleton skull? That's actually something I really need as well. But I don't have looting three yet. Oh man, this is why I want looting three so I can get all the good stuffs. Man. Dude, this season is tough on me at the moment. I can't seem to get anything good going. It's so sad. I say that, I mean, my village is pretty good, but you know. Just not, not all the ones I need just yet. Just get infinity. Yeah, infinity's fine sometimes, but then you can't have mending on it, can you? So what's the point of that? <laughs> I'd rather have mending and then have a, a stack of arrows in my inventory. Takes up the same amount of space as one arrow, so, you know. Preferences, I guess. Everyone has different. Infinity's better than mending? Nah, it's not. Not when you want to use your bow and arrow quite a lot. I guess if you had multiple bows and spare ones and stuff, that'd be fine. You can only repair stuff so much. You can't keep repairing it over and over again. It becomes too expensive after a while, which is the, which was the issue before mending. When do you remember when we used to have armor and you'd have to like, yeah, you'd have to like repair it up to a certain point, and then it was just too damaged to like repair anymore, and you couldn't. It was too expensive. So yeah. Um. Oh yeah, let's go check out this other spawner as well that apparently exists. I think it's near the surface, apparently. I've heard. Let's have a quick run around. Let's see if we can find it. I'm not sure where it is. Yeah, bows are cheap to fix, yeah, until they get too expensive, like I just said. <laughs> it's not whether or not like, something's easy to fix. It's like after after ten like repairs or however many no, I guess like three repairs. I don't know where the spawner is. Let's let's guess it's over here. I don't know. Any villagers have looting three? Mine don't at the moment, no. Oh, what is- wait, what is this? What is this? We've not been down here yet. What is this place? This is awful. I don't like the, um... The weird hole down there. Oh, I keep getting to grab a shield. Shields are very handy. What is this cave? Is this not weird? I don't think the spawn is down here. <laughs> but I could do with lighting up the areas around my base anyway, so... Might as well pop in. Oh my goodness, it literally went around in a loop. There's literally a loop. <laughs> That's so odd. How odd is that? That is so strange. Okay, well, whatever. Um, where's the way back out again, though? Up here, I guess. Uh, wait, where is the way back up? I'm lost! It's over here. Here we go. Found it! So yeah, that's lit up now. Cool. So yeah, obviously the thing isn't there. Um, let's take our coordinates a little bit. Um, I guess it's minus... Okay, it's further this way. Which actually could be a really good shout, because I plan on building first over this end. So if there's something like a spawner over this end... We can have that built first and then build around it, you know? That's a difficult thing, I think, with them. Um, with the uh, farms, I find. Like, it's, it's it's great if you build the farm first and then do the design afterwards, but doing, like, figuring out your design first is difficult. Um, Doing it that way around. So, so apparently it's over this way. Maybe it's off the island. I'm not sure actually, it could be, it could be on the island over there. We could make uh, one of these little islands like a spawner island. That could be cool. Yeah, 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 it might be over here. We're still technically counting as my base, I guess these little little bits. Just haven't changed, uh, got, got rid of any, um, any, uh, trees over here. Got some sugar cane growing. So the hole in the ground must be over here somewhere. What about this? What is this? Why are there dangerous looking caves everywhere? <laughs> is that where a spawner might be? Could be. Oh, what happened over here? Who's been here and left floating trees? Who actually has been here and left floating trees in a crafting bench? How dare they? How very dare they? I've not got any blocks on me. I don't think it was me. I don't think I came out this far to get rid of trees. Which I'm gonna have to use my two crafting benches now to do this. <laughs> oh. There we go. 
Yeah, if anyone's got any questions, now's a great time while I'm uh, reading chat. Get rid of it. In fact, you know what? Let me just get rid of this tree. Just do three fruit berries with the same enchants in infinity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, uh... I don't know. I'd like to do it different ways. Um, and like I say, everyone has different preferences when it comes to the tools and armor and everything. So, let's pop over here. So, 54... Minus 35. It's here, apparently. I don't think this exists. I think I've got the wrong coordinates here. 58. Yeah, I think I've got the wrong coordinates here. I don't think this is right. I don't think this is right at all. It must be in this cave. This cave must lead to it. Should we go down in the water? <laughs> sure, why not? Oh, in fact, it is here. Okay, okay. Oh, wait, skeletons. Oh, this is bad. I haven't got any blocks on me. Oh, no, no, no. Give me blocks. I don't have any blocks. Hi. No, it's fine. You don't have... Oh, wait, you don't have a powerful boat. Okay. Oh, no, that guy does. That guy does. That guy does. Okay, get out of here first. And then this guy. Oh, no, they're having a fight. Oh. Yes. Oh, wait, oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I thought there was a second spawner. There is not. There's not a second spawner. Oh, don't die. Don't die to, die to a skeleton. Don't do it. Don't do it. No. 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 I'm not going to die to a skeleton. I'm not happening. Uh, someone told me about this spawner, Linda. Um, but you can you can find spawners in, like, uh, maybe a mist. Does a mist work like that? I guess so. Okay, cool. I'm glad I came down here then. <laughs> My coordinates weren't quite accurate. Oh. I didn't think we did. Uh, we haven't. Oh, that's why I can't hear mobs. Literally on 3%. Oh, that's because of the Ender Dragon, that is. Uh, if you guys haven't seen my last video, by the way, it's the funniest. <laughs> it's the funniest thing. Um, if you want to see myself and ZF try and fight the Ender Dragon in the strangest way possible. Wait, why does it sound like there's another spawner this way? It probably isn't, but... Sounds like there could be. Oh my goodness, hi, I didn't mean to open you all up! No! There's a cave. Well, I do need to do lighting up of my caves anyway, right? If I want, like, farms that are more efficient, I guess. I guess it has to be, like, mob farms specifically, though. But, uh, ooh, <laughs> there's floating sand up there as well. I'm gonna accidentally fall in there one day when I get rid of that sand. Two derps in a boat. That's the name of the video, yeah. But I would recommend watching that or, or set off version of it. It's, uh, it's a pretty fun one. How many deaths have I got right now, actually? Two, <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Green's got 16 and Scar's got 25. Are they in a competition? Maybe. How big of a dilly is there? Not a very big one. I believe. Watching that fight happen in the other hermits videos is great. I've not I've not seen what how the other hermits reacted. I'm guessing like people seeing that um there were deaths and stuff. Potentially um <laughs> potentially was funny. I don't know. <laughs> You're gonna watch it now, Crazy Waffle? Fair enough. Feel free to, dude. Feel free to. Any more plans for collabs? Indeed, yeah. Well, no plans, but it, more collabs will happen. <laughs> nice rigs, yeah. I mean, that's how you high five in Minecraft. You have to hit each other with whatever you're holding. Just you gotta hit each other. That's just it. You know, it, it, high fives are better when both both of you hit each other at the same time. But you know, <laughs> it's quite hard to do uh, in Minecraft. So you just hit each other, no matter what. It works. Ah, oh, why have I got like? I don't want friendly. I don't want you guys making noises in here because that's the most frustrating thing I find in Minecraft. Friend, having having friendly uh friendly animal noises on. I I don't like it. Maybe that's just me in Minecraft. I, probably. 
holding sword yeah i mean no holding the sword is sort of not uh, a high five is it really that's just an attack uh, <laughs> i'm pretty sure i have punched someone before hit them with like something like an axe and then i've killed them i think that happened with ren at some point didn't it at some point i don't remember when that was but i think he was low on health and then i like high fived him and like you know didn't go well um I could call them all silence me, but I think that's probably a bad idea. Right, do I need any more cats for this creeper farm? Or is like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven enough? I think seven might be enough. Seven might be enough. Right, um, okay, what was next on my list? I really want to go get, the, get this gravel, now that I've got a portal there, but I don't think we're going to be able to do that without having... Uh, a fixed shovel. Anyone know where there's an XP farm? I mean, I guess I've got like an XP farm, but I think it's going to take too long to like, to deal with that. I know I have one, but it's like just not very good. I mean, let's, let's pop down there with it. Let's, let's see. Let's, let's see. There's a fair amount of people online, so we might not get... Might not be that great. I don't know. We'll see. But, oh my goodness. Can I get down there? Thanks. Impulse's guardian farm. Yeah. I mean, I have my... <laughs> I really... I should really ch uh, change my uh, guardian farm to be uh, XP related. That would be really great. Oh, so we do have you here. Hello. He was holding cobblestone. Wait, how is he holding cobblestone? Oh no. Scar? Oh, we've got a lot of bad guys coming. Okay. Let's hang out here for a second. Um, yeah, that might be the best um, one so far. Uh, Impulse's one. But yeah, having my own XP farm would be kind of great. Our XP farm is really laggy. because It'd be cool to have one on my base, but I'm not sure what the best options are for that. What's a good like underground like XP farm? F's in the chat for Scar. Yes, let's, let's continue. Continue that. He's going for 27. He might be. Oh my goodness, look at you guys. Matching gold armor. Ruining my diamond, my uh, stone sword. In fact, I should probably make some more swords. I don't have any, uh... Oh no, because I don't have any, uh... Any wood down here. <laughs> That's stupid. Okay, well, whatever. Maybe I can punch him to death with my pickaxe. I'll choose that. Um... A cactus smelter. A furnace right here, but that's not great though. That's not great. That requires you to have like I, I meant like mob XP farm, I think. I don't know actually if if uh I think ZF said something about the end clear, clearing it up. Um I was quite happy to do it as well, but then I didn't I forgot to check with him whether or not he'd done it already or not, so I haven't actually been to the end. To see if it's still uh flooded or not. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that baby just like instantly died. Did you hear him? He just went splat on the floor. I should probably have a sword down here, shouldn't I? Like a, a hopper chest. I should do. That's going to be my next upgrade for down here. I say upgrade. <laughs> the whole thing needs upgrading, I think. Disenchant the armor to fix my shovel. Disenchant. Oh, this armor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does that give me XP? It does, doesn't it? What if I get this stuff? Will it be a lot though? Ah. Oh. Interesting. Yeah, maybe a grindstone's worth getting down here then. Fine. Let's grab one to put down there. Sorry I'm late, false. I forgot to eat breakfast yesterday because I was too busy watching your stream. <laughs> Fell, you can't miss breakfast because of my stream. <laughs> Can't blame me for that. Thank you though for the uh, 500 biddies. I appreciate that. Neg Tricks as well coming in with the uh, three month sub and Eight Bit Kid with the ten months. Fishbird with the 50 biddies as well. Thank you guys for the uh, the support. Appreciate those. Let's grab. Oh, let's put you in here. In fact, yeah, I don't. Mm. Mm. How do you do that trap? That's like the simpler zombie XP farm. If you search like simple zombie XP farm on YouTube, you'll come up with a tutorial. I'm sure. Uh, but yeah, grindstone. So I have a grindstone over there. Let's make a new one. I don't know how to make one, though. 
So I'm gonna have to look it up. That's not how I spell grindstone. Oh, okay, weird. Weird, um, I wouldn't have guessed that. I wouldn't have been able to guess that at all. That's, uh, yeah, not an easy recipe to remember that one. Well, I guess it is. It sort of looks like the grindstone, right? Got two wooden bits holding onto the stone bit in the middle. Although I think that would probably let not be a slab and more so a full block, but yeah, that makes sense. Will I disenchant and get more zombies? Yeah, I reckon so. Let's let's test it out with the armor that we have in there. I should have put my iron down for the hopper, but we won't do that right now. I do want to try this out for size. So if I put that there and we grab out some like this stuff. Does that, does that even give us XP? Oh, it does. Oh, we have to like stand right next to it though. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Not bad. Might keep some stuff though here. So the stuff I will keep, I will put down the bottom. Because you never know when you're gonna need just some like, you know, basic, basic armor. <laughs> um, just for lols. So yeah, let's grab some of this stuff. We could repair it. Can you repair chain with a... Uh... You can't repair it with iron, can you? I'm not sure. Anyway, any more in there? Iron ingots. Okay. Huh. That actually did, didn't do too bad. Okay, cool. That's really good to know. I, uh, yeah, I wasn't very, wasn't very aware that that was a thing to use. The grinder next to the block sometimes traps the XP. What do you mean trap, traps the XP? Chain repairs only with itself. That's what I thought. So I could like put that and that. Oh, I haven't got it. Wait, I've got an anvil down here. Not that it's a very good use of levels right now, but <laughs> but yeah, that can work. That can work. You can smelt them down. Oh, nothing's here. I don't know why I'm, I'm swinging. Oh, I'm swinging because there's a baby. There's a baby down there. Yeah, I definitely need to like make this a better, a better option. Smelt. Can you automate the grindstone? I don't think so. Right, I think I, th I think our shovel's ready to roll actually, so we should be good to good to take it on a spin. A freestanding grinder will give you XP without having to stand right next to it. Hmm, interesting. I'll have to look into that. But yeah, that's not a bad spawner, it's just the, the fact that I died there. <laughs> um, and you've got that sort of social spawning aspect. Other than that, the, the spawner's fine. Right, um, so yeah, I want to use a shovel real quick on some gravel so we can get uh, started on our base in the next, next little while, I think. I'm not going to say like next week or the week after or anything, but I do really, really want to start just like some stuff. And we need concrete for it, so... If I can get myself geared up, because I have two chests full of sand already, and only half a chest full of uh, full of gravel. So if we pop to the gravel, oh, I should have put silk oh, silk touch needs to go on the shovel, doesn't it? That's what we need to do, right? I'm so glad I remembered that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That one needs efficiency on it. But yeah, this one can have silk touch. Uh, where's the books? In here. That's what we we're gonna do, so we don't get any um. Yeah, so we don't get any flint. Genius. And we've got our non-silk touch. Wait, where is our silk touch? Here it is. Need to put them all in there. There we go. Bingo. 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 Oh yeah, I do want to make a group form. That is something I will be making at some point. You can't put links in the chat, by the way, guys. Whether it's a link I allow or not. <laughs> I don't need shulker boxes, I've got my inner chest which has shulker boxes in it. 
You slept all night. You're playing Ori and Will of the Wisps. How how is how is Ori and and the Will of the Wisps? I'm uh, I'm really excited to play that. But I'm doing it uh, maybe this week if 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 I if I my plans go well. If not, I'm not sure. It's all good, Hazard. Yeah, I'm just telling people that links don't work because just saves you time trying to post them. Right, this one's this person's got um. Wait, is this it? No, this isn't it. It's a little bit further. In fact, it's this way. Ori wraps up the story nicely. Sweet. I don't really remember the story too much from the first one, other than like the very basics. So I'll have to uh, maybe get a recap. Go to the shopping district. I will do it at the end of the stream. Because uh, if we pass on the stream torch to someone, to impulse, that'll be a really good place to meet them. So we'll do that towards the end. Please tell me I made a portal over here. I did, didn't lie to the uh, gravelly area. Pretty certain I did. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> In the distance. We has it. Guys, if you want to, like, you know, chat in the chat, please type something, like, helpful or, you know, say hi or something. Like, just spamming emotes just isn't helpful for anyone. <laughs> okay. Oh, of course the sun's going down. Really? Oh, no, we're going to have the phantoms all over again, aren't we? <laughs> oh, why did I not? I not? Oh, okay. It's fine. It's fine. This will be fine. We'll just pretend it's completely safe over here. It's all good. But yeah, this is our gravel mine. I've claimed it. Um, <laughs> um, but yeah, so we're graveling up as much as we can so that I can uh, get my concrete going so I can get building. In fact, speaking of speaking of concrete, right? I don't really build out concrete very much, but I've got a question for you guys. What is your favorite kind of like building resource? Like, do you build out of wood most, stone most, concrete, wool? Like, what well, what's your go-to like block type? You build out of dirt, <laughs> stone. Yeah, I feel like stone is definitely what I build out of most probably. Oh, I'm definitely gonna get phantoms on. I know, please. Please. Real phantoms in a moment. Concrete. Okay, quite a lot of people with concrete then. Okay, if you use concrete, what 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 kind of color what color concrete do you go with the most? Like what's your common common concrete? <laughs> your common concrete. Yeah, what's your most common concrete? Color. Just just those that, that, that were saying they use concrete. Because I'm curious. White. Quite a lot of white. Some grey. White and grey. Interesting. So does that mean a lot of you guys are like doing modern style builds then? I would assume. That's probably the like classic go-to colour scheme for modern. I would say. Cyan. Interesting. Modern skyscrapers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Skyscrapers as well, I guess. A very good shout for concrete. Interesting. Futuristic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, okay, people said concrete a heck of a lot more than I realised, to be honest. I expected everyone to say stone and wood and stuff, but no, you guys are like concrete mad. It's kind of interesting. Maybe maybe I'm really stuck in my ways in terms of like using like older blocks as like my main blocks. I don't think I've ever built just out of concrete unless it's been like a small little modern house or something, you know? How have I not been bothered by mobs yet? None of these mobs are like bothered by me. They're just like hanging out, you know. We're just hanging out. I bet I've jinxed it. Creep's gonna blow me up now. It's so rant. You like the face cam off? You can see more of what I'm doing. <laughs> Thanks. No, I mean I've never said that I'll always keep the face cam. Uh, just I don't know. I quite like having face cam. Just today I wasn't feeling it. And I wasn't like, you know what? I don't need it. I'm gonna get rid of it. <laughs> and here it isn't. It's not here today. The gravel rep repels them. <laughs> what mobs? Mobs really hate gravel. Probably what they're scared of the most. 
Look at this spider, it's absolutely hating falling all over the gravel right now. I don't take music suggestions, no. Every every hermit, um, if you aren't already aware, has a different streaming style. Uh, I love chatting with you guys. You know, we, we start a lot of conversations and just sort of derp around and stuff. Um, that's sort of how I, I guess, do my streams. Um, Doc, it's, Doc's very much music um, based with some of his streams. Um, Azuma is very much sort of uh, likes to have a topic to talk about. <laughs> yeah, I feel like everyone's sort of got their like thing, you know. Um, so yeah, um, don't I guess always assume that everyone don't don't assume that every streamer has the same like rules and the same like ideas about sort of how their stream goes. I'm a Minecraft and not a DJ. I mean, I have I have done DJ related streams in the past. Does anyone does anyone here remember False DJ Fridays? I actually wonder how many people here remember remember those. A7 does, of course. <laughs> False DJ Fridays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, most people in chat are gonna be like, "What? What was that?" See. See, but before before Do before Doc stole it. Uh, <laughs> That's why it, um, yeah, I did the DJ thing. Ah, exactly. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. You think Doc's the original creator of such a, such an thing. <laughs> no. Um, but yeah, no, that, that was something that used to happen, uh, on my streams. But then copyright became like a big issue on uh, Twitch. So I, I, I probably want to, I actually want to contact Twitch actually, um, and see where they stand now with it because... It's it's so weird when it comes to copyright music on, on streams. Twitch is so like sometimes they'll act, but sometimes they just will be fine with it. Like there's so many streamers I think on Twitch that just use whatever. Can we play Frozen again? <laughs> no, Scar, no Frozen for you. I'm sorry. I actually don't. Ha oh, wait, well, you no, know, I played that on my oh in my stream deck. Yeah, no, I my stream deck isn't set up for those anymore. Oh, it's so sad. I'm gonna. I, I need to reset my stream deck up properly. But uh, but yeah, I'll I'll, I'll get that. I'll get that request just for you, Scar. <laughs> I know how much of a big uh, fan of Frozen you are, Scar. So you know, I'll uh, I'll get that request just for you. Um, you miss and don't miss full studio Fridays. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy wants to let it go. He does. I mean, he did earlier. He, he let it go to a blaze. All of his items, I guess, went to the blaze. <laughs> that's, not what the, that's not what the song means, Scar. Gotta fight the blaze. Hope you got your stuff back. <laughs> blaze is blaze are mean, man. Blaze are mean. They really are. Okay, that's pretty good. I'm, I'm happy about that. Ha ha! One lot of gravel done. Am I building my next base out of gravel? No, I'm using concrete. <laughs> and if anyone... Well, I was just about to say if anyone uses concrete, uh, which, as we've found out, a lot of people do. Um, you, 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 know, you know the grind in survival about concrete then, don't you? I, I guarantee that my base, because of the scale I'm going this season, I probably haven't got even half the amount of gravel I need for my main base yet. But I'm going to be doing a lot of gravel mining and stuff off camera. Just so that we aren't just gravel mining forever, because otherwise we will. <laughs> It'll become a gravel mining stream. That's all my stream will be, forever and ever. What about water? What, what about water? I mean, you need water, yes, but water is just anywhere in the world. Like, you can get water anywhere, so... I'm not going to have to go searching for that, am I? <laughs> Gravel and sand are a different matter. But now that the shoveled silk touch, I need to get gravel, because then I don't need any flints messing up my storage by filling it all up. Sand mining stream? We did some sand mining last time. We have two stacks of, uh, two double chests of sand at the moment. I just don't have the same amount of gravel, and you obviously need, like, equal amounts, so... And gravel's, I think, harder to find, so I'm trying to, like, I don't know, get all this gravel at some point. 
I think gravel is probably that little bit less um, satisfying to sand. Sand's perhaps a little bit easier because it's just everywhere. Whereas gravel needs to be a bit more precise with it, but it's still the same like noise it makes and stuff, right? Sort of. For UHD, I I uh, I was at one point thinking about doing UHDs on stream again, but um, like speed UHDs and stuff, but. I just haven't had the I just haven't had the drive to do it. I just haven't really gone. Oh, I really fancy playing UHC again. Maybe at some point we'll bring it back, but um, but for the moment we'll just stick with our monthly Patreon UHC that happens that we stream. That's probably what I'm gonna stick with for now. JT and Bex, I just realised you guys also uh, gifted a Scar a sub. Thank you very much for that. I appreciate that. Intro as well, uh, gifted um, some biddies. And Kaz with the 100 biddies as well. Me, I, Maya as well with the 100 biddies. With the, with the message, I just want attention. <laughs> There's your attention. I hope you uh, hope you enjoy the attention there. Um, thank you, thank you very, very much for those biddies. Okay, okay. How are we doing with gravel now, do we think? How are we doing? UHC, what is UHC? UHC stands for Ultra Hardcore, meaning um, it's usually a PvP based game where everybody has one uh, lot of hearts, like your heart's at the bottom, you only have one lot of them. Uh, if you lose a heart, you can only get that back by regenerating with uh, golden apples or potions. Um, and yeah, it's basically a survival game where you have an hour maybe on average I guess uh, or two to play in a world and there's like a border that shrinks and you've basically got yourself and a uh, lot of other teams um, around the world and basically you're just gonna fight it out if you come across them you actually is when Zaziki wins yeah 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 I mean <laughs> Zaziki's the the reigning champion on on our Patreon server <laughs> If anyone, if anyone really great at UHC wants to join us uh, for a Patreon server, please, uh, for a Patreon UHC, feel feel free to become a Patreon because my goodness, Ziggy needs to, uh, I don't know, Ziggy needs to not win for once. <laughs> Is Ziggy in the chat? Is he gonna kill me? We've done Hammercraft UHC games before. We just haven't done done them for a while, but yeah. They're all in playlists on my YouTube channel. If you're ever, if you're ever interested in looking back at them. So Ziggy needs more victims. <laughs> the Hunt the Hermit series, yeah, that was a cool, fun series. Uh, what were the other series we did? We did some UHB, which was interesting. The the it was UHC, but like a build off at the same time or something. I'm not really quite sure what that concept was. It was interesting though. What else did we do? Huh? I don't know. I can't remember what the other ones were called. We've never seen this much gravel in one place. If you ever want this much gravel for like concrete. Uh, find um, a extreme hills mountain biome. On like a mist there, like under extreme hills M. You've got to have that M. That M means that there's gravel somehow. <laughs> um, and there'll be a lot of it. Like it goes quite away. It cover. It sort of covers all the stone in the area. Oceans work too, yeah, but I don't have um, a way of breathing underwater other than... Actually, no, I don't have a way of breathing underwater. I was about to say that I, I have a... Um... Well, what's the underwater beacon -y thing? I have one of those, but I don't have the shell, I think, to make it. Suicidal Nuggets, thank you for the four-month resub. Thank you for that. Welcome back to the fourth family. What do I think about Hightail? Um... I think it's going to be interesting. <laughs> uh, I'm excited to see what it looks like um, and how it plays and stuff. Um, but I haven't been really keeping up with updates. I don't think they've been even updating all as much as they, they previously were. But it's going to be an interesting one for sure. Right, do you reckon that's enough gravel for now? I think, I think we'll take a break from the gravel mining. 
People don't want to see me mining gravel for the whole stream. What have we got? We've got 40 minutes left? Okay, we're good. Let's go... Nope, this way, I think. Yeah. Not using new blocks or conduits. I'm not stuck in my old ways because I'm trying to use concrete this season. <laughs> Um, I use, um, I've used, like, observers and things. I'm also doing the villager thing, which, uh, which is new to me. So, I'm trying new things this season. I should make a concrete shop. Concrete shop went, like, there's no, okay, so there's no use making a shop of a material that you yourself need a lot of. If I need a lot of concrete, there's no use me trying to gather up double the amount that I need because I'm going to sell it as well. That's a terrible idea. Um, never sell something you, you you yourself are going to need a lot of because otherwise you're just going to be gathering forever, uh, said Block, you know? Um, so that's why I won't be doing that. Every time I say I'm going to make a farm for, for my own personal like use, everyone's like, make a, make a shop for that. And I'm like, no, it's for my personal use. Like I need, I need those blocks myself. <laughs> if I start selling them, and then I need, then I find that I like need even more of them. I don't want to have to like keep taking stock out of my own shop, because then I'm not going to be selling it, am I? So, it just logically, just doesn't work like that. Um, so yeah. A ham and cheese sandwich. Thanks for that message. I could, I could do with a ham and cheese sandwich right now. That sounds quite nice. I haven't had one of those in. A while. Right, gravel. Have we got like at least one chest full right now? I think we should do. We should do. Uh, yeah, we do. Teaching you something important today. Never get your own. Never get on your own supply. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Indeed. Wouldn't recommend. Spam and cheese. I don't think I've ever had spam. I've never had spam. Doesn't doesn't appeal to me very much. <laughs> I've never thought, you know what? That's what I need in my life. I need to try some spam. No, it's just not. It's just not interesting to me. I don't I don't want it. It's not not interesting. <laughs> oh. Okay, we need to remember this by the way. Drop this off to impulse later. Um I got another couple of fish. I got one more fish. Okay, let's get. Oh wait, no. You said you guys said tropical fish work, didn't you? Wait, does it work? Oh, you guys lied to me the other day. No, I don't. <laughs> it needs to be uh, the other kinds of fish. What's about that thing in Australia called Vegemite? I mean, I've never had um, Marmite, let alone Vegemite. I don't want either. I'm happy. I'm happy with my non... whatever those things are. I don't know. Tropical fish. Yeah, we need need cod. If they don't, if they don't mind spawning. Cod or salmon, yeah. I gathered up the, the, the tropical because there's so many, but... They obviously don't work! <laughs> the cats are very, very picky. Do you want to help me out, dolphin? Give me some uh, boost, perhaps. Oh, there's, a, there's a singular cod over here that I could use. Wee, missed him. Wee, got it. No, right now, yeah, okay, got it. Let's not drown. Okay, there's literally none spawning anywhere, but this will do. We literally just need two uh, fish, and we've got one in our storage. Make sure to check every dolphin for a name tag. That one didn't have a name tag, I'm pretty sure. It's fine. The ocean is humongous, so if someone's lost a dolphin, it's lost forever. <laughs> I guarantee you. I guarantee you it's lost forever. Season 7, Queen of Cats. <laughs> These are from my creeper farm. Leave me alone, okay? They're worker, they're worker cats. <laughs> it's the worker cats. They're having a break from their, their, their future work. <laughs> they are kind of terrifying when they will just stare at you, though, like that. I pay, yeah, totally, I pay them in fish. It's fine. Um, Jem's got a lot of worker cats too. I, I almost, I almost think that this season everyone's gonna have, um, 
everyone's gonna go for a... What do I use? Not silk touch. Um, everyone's gonna go for uh, creep farms. Yeah, how long? Well, you know what? Let me do this out here. Just, just about to uh, try and repair my shovel a bit more with these guys. But let's do this. Let's do this the old-fashioned way. Does anyone do it like this anymore? Where they build a big pillar? Does it? I have not seen anyone do it this way for ages. This is so season five. This. Great, it does. Fair enough. I've not seen anyone do it. Like, everyone used to do this it this way. Now that I think we've got our, like, second hand. No, I guess the second hand we did it then as well. <laughs> I know, Kingfisher, but if, if someone's, like... If someone's really great at farms and they make farms every season, like of course they're gonna be quicker than someone that doesn't make farms every season. Um, they're just gonna like set them up and then have them done forever, you know. I I don't I don't like the idea of um, rushing everything. For me personally, I'll get them done when I get them done. I've already got my elytra, so all I need is some. Some, uh, some, uh, some other stuffs, and then we're good. The rockets. Okay, that wasn't even that much coal. I didn't repair my shovel very much either. That's, that's, that's the problem with having... In a way, sort of having mending on a fortune sort of doesn't really make sense. When you want it for that situation. <laughs> it sort of, like, steals all of the uh, XP. Came farm, yeah. We need to make a, a better farm at some point. It's already grown again, though, man. Like this farm's pretty good. It does keep me keep me stocked. Uh, what else was I gonna get on today? Um, we were gonna pop on over to the shopping district, but we don't we would we don't want to re really have to come back and then go back there for impulse. So we'll wait another like 10, 15 minutes before we head there. Um, in 10, 15 minutes. Ooh, I don't know. What, what, do, what do you guys want to see in the next 10-15 minutes? What should, we, what should we get on with? I can, you know what? Actually, no, I know exactly what I'm going to get on with. I think I'm going to mark out my base a little bit. Try and get a bit of a uh, a shape going. Let you guys see a bit of the shape of the uh, part of the base, shall we? <laughs> Although that's going to be quite challenging. No, yeah, that'll be fine. Just need some dirt. People keep asking about the face cam. If the face cam isn't there, then the face cam isn't happening. <laughs> just the heads up. That just will answer your question. What are we doing for my base? Something big. Something big. Go big or go home, as I like to say. Be careful, Jevin's farm didn't work. What farm? What farm did he make? Uh, one... Two, three, two, three, four, five. <laughs> no cams. If I've got a spot, I don't care about having a face cam on. <laughs> I'm not that, um, uh, self. What's the word I want? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I don't care that much. Um, no, I had allergies uh, uh, pretty bad earlier, so I'm, I'm just just chilling. I'm chilling. I haven't got a very bright light on. It's quite nice. One, two, three, four, five. Cool. Coolly cool. I'm not making a circle. This is not a circle. That's not how you make a circle. I know how to make circles, obviously. <laughs> no, that's not this is this is not circular. Does that look circular to you? If it does, then you're not regular circles in Minecraft. If this block wasn't here, it could definitely become a circle. But it's not. 
It's curvy, yeah. Curvy, yes, but not anything else. Right, what coordinate am I on here? I'm just going to double check that I'm doing this correctly. Um, actually, I don't have the coordinates for that, but that'll, that'll be fine. Oh, hello. It's roundish, yeah. I do like round shapes in general in Minecraft. I'll never say no to a circle. It's a crescent. <laughs> I can't even see what it looks like. Because <laughs> it is just like... I don't know, let me get back, let me get this boat, this might be easier. Um, let me look at what block this is real quick. It is... 3, 2, 3. Today is circle day. It's pie day. Yeah. Yeah, we're making a pie. A big a big stone pie. That's the aim today. There's another whole boat over here. <laughs> oh. oh, I feel I feel kind of scared like building putting actual blocks down for the base even though the the I'm not going to put a lot down today. This does feel a bit, it feels a bit, I don't know, premature maybe. Oh, that's not what I want. One, two, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. So this right here should be up with that. It does, three, two, three. Circles are illegal in the game when building blocks for a nice awesome cube. Dude, I always build up circles. <laughs> I don't want I don't wanna go with the, the rules of the game. Everything being square. CT! Thousand biddies! Thank you so much for the thousand biddies. Appreciate those. Thank you, thank you. Illegal? What's illegal? Build only in ovals. We may build a little bit overly um, this season. I have an oval in mind. Paired with a circle. Oh my goodness, what? Spoilers. <laughs> I've not seen your uh, symmetry in base, uh, Gakko, I don't think. Well, I might have done, but I, trying to remember what people have built is, is in, impossible. I'm not insult. I'm not. Ins I'm not insulting circles on Pi Day, dude. I love. I love me a circle. Oh, I've run out of stone. <laughs> How many blocks did I need? Like five more. How long was I playing Minecraft before I started playing it full time as my job? Uh, what year did I start? Well, what, if, if you work out what year I joined Hermitcraft, what year was that? Was that 2013? I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I, you know what, I don't actually know what year I joined Hermitcraft. <laughs> it's really bad of me. <laughs> 2014? I knew it was about then. I know that um, Minecon um, London was 2015. That was one of my first ev big events. <laughs> and it showed. Um, and... Yeah, so it was obviously before then. 2014. So, but then I've been playing since 2010. So, four years before I was doing Minecraft as my job, in a way. <laughs> yeah, I think I think that's the answer. About around four years. Obviously, give or take a few months here and there. But yeah, 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 that about four years. I never really thought about that before. Sorry, I didn't really have an answer ready. But yeah, if anyone's got any questions, feel free to ask away. I will. I'll answer some questions, perhaps. What do you guys think of that shape? <laughs> it's so... Like, I could I could build on that some more, but I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave you guys on a cliffhanger of what it's gonna turn into. Geocraft? Ge Ge Geocraft. Uh, Geocraft doesn't exist. Uh, Geomine, however, <laughs> did exist. Um... Uh, how was it? 
Uh, um, good. Yeah, it was a completely different style of server, completely. I know that um, Azim has obviously spoken about Geomine a lot. Um, because, uh, for those that don't know, I'm pretty sure Azima mentioned this in his... I know he mentioned it in, I don't know, a video or a stream or something. Um, uh, that was that was how Azuma and I met. He invited me to his Geomine server. Um, back, we don't know, 2012? 2012? I'm gonna guess 2012, I don't really know. Uh, <laughs> really early, basically. Before Hermitcraft. Um, so yeah, I think that he's probably, he's probably the guy that I've known the longest if I'm in, in that respect. I don't think I knew anyone else before that. But yeah, he spoke, yeah, he's spoken about Geomine. If you, if you're interested in, uh, in Geomine and how it got started and etc, etc. Uh, literally, um, yeah, Mumble was on there as well. Uh, and other people as well. Um, but yeah, he's, he made a video on his uh, second channel about it, so. Just go there. He, he, he explains it a lot better than, than I will. Um, yes. Um, he still has the GMI world save? Yeah, he's done a tour of it before because I remember being in the stream when he did it and I was like, oh my goodness. Blast from the past. I kind of want to look at this from the sky. Can we look at it from the sky? Let's get my elytra out. <laughs> get my get my elytra out just, just for like five seconds here and there. There you go. I'm ready. Yeah, so fun fact, I, I, start, I, made, I made videos before Azuma did, in that respect, I think. Because I don't think he was making videos at that point. Look at that shape! What a shape that is! See? There's a big straight line, guys. That's not circle. That's not circle. Look at how straight that line is! Oh, it's such, such a straight... Such a straight line. Oh my goodness, I didn't really... <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize that was gonna happen. Uh, the nymphal symmetry. There is, there is no, there is no fun. There is no fun story about it. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I always feel like I should just like make up a really good story of why I'm called full symmetry, but I just don't have one. I just don't have one. What does it take to become a hermit? Um, uh, consistency. Um, gotta be a good fit for the group. Um, uh, insert many other things here, I don't know. Looks rectangular. Ooh, rectangular. Any tips on how to make a nice custom tree? You've just gotta, I, I recommend doing it in creative first and just thinking of the curves of a tree and just sort of, you've got to sort of, it's a lot of placing and then breaking blocks to get organic shapes to work if you're new to them. So I would recommend doing it that way. My favorite biome, um, ocean or, um, I don't know when it comes to biomes, if I'm honest, I don't think I ever really use the biome as the biome. Like I've just picked a rat I've just picked a piece of land that I really liked. This could have been this could have been like spruce forest, this could have been roofed forest, this could have been flower forest, this could have been anything with grass, basically. <laughs> Cause it the, the biome itself doesn't matter to me. So and the same with last season as well. And then with the Mesa, yeah, again it didn't really matter because I just bought a jellyfish. <laughs> Cause I could. <laughs> um yeah, so for me, the biome doesn't matter so much. This this build could have been really cool in a swamp, actually. A swamp would have been really cool. Base camp guide? No, I've just not got it on. Uh, Fel, just just call me false, honestly. I, I much prefer that. It's the same with anyone else. You, you call them by their, their name. What they have. The swamp needs some work. What swamp needs some work? The swamp, arguably, for the what I'm gonna build, needs less work. I could have I could have picked a swamp. But there wasn't a swamp in an area near everybody else, so I picked this area instead. But like I say, the bite like like I said, the biome doesn't matter, because most of my builds I think are unrelated. The biome is more like what 
the situation that the... Uh, how do I explain that? I don't know. But basically, I don't think about the biome so much. I don't know the number of hermits I, I know I've seen in real life. Because I just don't count. <laughs> but quite a few of them. I don't know. It's not quite half, I don't think. Because there's a lot of American guys that have not met at an event before. Like B-dubs and, and people. Um, but yeah. Am I excited for a more dangerous nether? I'm not sure if excited's the word, if I'm honest. I'm not sure if excited's the word. I really want to get rid of the sugarcane, but I think I'm just going to leave it until I have the sugarcane farm set up. Because otherwise I'll figure out that I need sugarcane stuff, and then I'll... yeah. Guys, there is a sort, a sort of sort of privacy when it comes to uh, YouTube stuff. I, I noticed that, that a lot of people ask personal questions when it comes to just any anyone, any streamers, any any YouTubers. Just I think just take take it as like they've shared the information that they want to share in that respect. Um, asking about it constantly just sort of makes you I don't know seem obsessed with sort of knowing this sort of stuff, which. It's not a good book. <laughs> New vines? Yeah, isn't there some sort of like vine thing that you can climb now? I think I saw Sark post it on Twitter. I've not looked at the net with the new nether, to be honest, so I don't really know. Right, we've actually got 20 minutes left of the stream. We might head to the shopping district. Let's take the stream torch with us, though. Proper fans respect privacy. Indeed, indeed. I'm totally with that. Yeah. I understand that obviously there are some young people that watch that don't, I think, understand the privacy thing just yet, but just, yeah. <laughs> How many eyes do I have? What? Because you can't see right now. I've got, I've got, I've got one underneath my helmet, so I've got a third eye. Secretly. But I can't take my helmet off, so... Oh wait, my helmet's about to break! <laughs> you might see it underneath there. Um, three eyes, yes. Um, do I feel closer to other UK helmets? Uh, honestly, people's location doesn't really make much difference. Um, <laughs> you know? Right, let's grab the... Oh, what did I do with this? Oh, what did I do with that stuff? I'll put it in here. Let's, um, do we really have to explode this TNT? How am I going to do that? I guess I need to do it in the nether, don't I? <laughs> Guys, I don't know. I don't like TNT. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. How do I feel about livestream weekends? I think they're really fun. It's nice to be able to uh, have streams that are a little bit sort of shorter than my normal streams. I go for about three hours normally, um, but to be able to have like a certain time schedule, because I sort of usually, um, I sort of don't really set myself a time schedule when it comes to streams. I just stream for as long as I feel like, for the most part. Um, Man, there's an awful lot of shops going on here. I feel totally left out of the shop game right now. What is that? I don't know, man. You get a good view up here, though. Squeaky Verret. Thank you much for the uh, 300 biddies. Thank you very much. Fuzzball as well with the 50 biddies. JT and Beck. Uh, J JT and Beck's also gifted us up to uh, Regulus. Uh, thank you very much for that. C CT with the... Did I miss did I miss CT with the 1000 bits again? I don't know. Thank you very much CT though. And Ace with the 100 bits. Thank you guys. You guys have been really supportive today. Thank you very much for that. Um The bases are now working. Yeah, I think I want to say that the server had to restart or something. Ooh, what is this? Souvenirs. One diamond per stack. Oh, that's that's a good deal. That's a good deal going on there. Is this impulses? It's very dark in here. Impulse, you're about to, you're about to, someone's gonna blow up. Breaking bedrock. 
Elytra. I don't need you. I got you myself. What is this? I feel like stress made this. I don't. Oh, it's actually stress's show. <laughs> I didn't know. I actually didn't know who built this. But I was like, it's gotta be stress. It's kind of adorable. Staff only. But what if I'm staff? I'm not staff. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, one diamond per stack. Nice. Dress has been grabbing all the uh, sand. Ow. Danger shop, though. Danger Oh, I should see how much looting is, actually. Just so I can get it on my sword so that when I'm actually killing things, I can actually loot them. My helmet broke. Yeah. <laughs> you can see my third eye. No. <laughs> um, more books inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need looting. Looting three. Five diamonds a book? Oh, what? Nah, mate. I'm gonna wait for my villager to appear. <laughs> I'm so, I am so... I am such a... Uh, what's the word? I'm such a tight... A tight ward at the moment. When it comes to, to using my diamonds. That's because I don't want to mine my di any more diamonds at the moment. I want to wait till I got a shop, but then I've got diamonds to hopefully replenish the ones I spend. I'm, fru I'm frugal, yes. I I'll take that, yes. Frugal. It's exactly what I am. I want to check out this shop. This one looks great. Honey pot. Honey blocks, honeycomb blocks, bee heads, beehives. Ooh, bee heads. That's just plain rude. Killing the bees like that. Ooh, beehives. I've not looked at beehives. Angry bee head, though. The angry bee head's pretty cool. I don't know how you farm, like, how you farm those, so I don't know how much they're, like, worth. You know? Like, I don't know how much. What is this? I think it's meant to be honey in a jar, but the, the lighting hasn't quite worked there. <gasps> Holy mackerel. Scar, showing off with the elytra. I've also got an elytra, so I can't really... <laughs> The shops are safe, no hostile mobs. Oh yeah, of course. <laughs> I didn't even think. Sorry, my bad. I'm so used to things be like being, I don't know, easily blown up. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, that's really funny. Um, <laughs> and I've lived on a mushroom bite before, so I should should know how they work. Um, ooh, oh, these are the people signed up so far. It's Cleo Beef and XP Crafted. Oh. Oh, 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 I'm going to come over here and read that properly in my in my video, I think, and sign up. Just so everybody, know, everybody knows I mean business. What's going back here? Is there anything else happening? There's a tree over here. The random tree. See, there are places for, for mobs to spawn then if there's a tree. That might not be a mushroom biome area. Might be a... That's the, th that's the thing that happened with my mushroom biome, was that around the edges there would be little areas of uh, non-mushroom biome. So technically, if you were to get AFK on here, you aren't 100% safe if you're too near the edge. <laughs> Magic scar flying off into the distance. It's a sacred tree. It might be. It might be. Right, what do I sell? I'm really... Hmm. I was going to do mending books, but there's already a, a battle between mending books, so we're just going to leave them to it. <laughs> um, and I'll just have my own mending books. Um, what's going to be a good shout this season? Wood could be, but I don't have a wood farm. Rocket Shop will 100% be made by Tango, like, in, like, this week, I guarantee it, almost. Um... So that's always something to think about. Um, how do you get Optifine? Optifine.com or Optifine.net, whichever one it is, I'm not sure. One of those. Terracotta. But I've got to mine up a lot of terracotta. Concrete's not going to work because I want concrete myself. Uh, lights. Is Ren doing a woodshop? Is he? Is he doing a woodshop again? 
Sand. I mean, there's already a glass shop. But sand could work, I guess. There must be one that... A really good shop that's going to, like, last the season and people are going to constantly want it. Because I keep making shops that people just don't really need to buy from all that often. And I just don't get enough of them. In the way of... Stuff. Enrods? Uh... An end related shop. Uh, people aren't. I don't think people use end related blocks very often. Mm. Wool. I mean, there's already a wool shop right here. I can't do any cheaper than that, so. So, yeah. But I will probably make my own sheep farm for my own personal use. Because <laughs> I want to make one. Not because I necessarily need the wool, but I really want to make one. I think they're cool. Now that, you, now that you can make them really easily and stuff. What is this park here? Golden carrots? It, it, but I don't have a gold farm. What is this? What is this? Dear, thank you very much for the kind of biddies. Thank you very much for that. Obsidian shop. Potentially. World Generation Aberration Monument. Okay. Thanks, Joe. <laughs> You can trade for golden carrots. Ah, oh, okay, so golden carrots. I'm going to write that down then. Because, uh, that might be a good shout. As, like, a nice easy one. That people might not necessarily fight over. Sea lanterns and stuff like that. I mean, at the moment, Impulse has the better farm, so. <laughs> ink. I will probably sell ink when I have the farm set up. But again, it will be as and when, because I would need black ink myself as well. But that will be easier because that will depend on how many people are on the server when I AFK. <laughs> redstone, redstone might be a good shout. That might be a good shout. I'm writing that down because it's quite easy to find more if I if I need them for my own uh, stuff. That's a good shout. Uh, N rods. Do I want N? Do I need an N rod shop? What else could be in the end rod shop? I feel like it needs to be a generalized end shop. Hmm. Can also trade redstone. What with villagers? Can you? Is it worth it, though? A flower and dye shop. Yeah. Yeah. Shulkers. Shulkers is the thing, isn't it? That might be a good shout. Yeah, sure, might be a good shout. Hmm, okay, cool. You guys have got an awful lot of really good ideas. Appreciate the, uh, <laughs> the spam. Lighting shop, uh, doesn't excite me very much. Scar's doing shulkers. This is what I mean, like, everybody's already doing all the shops. So, th there's gonna have to be a bit of competition sometimes with some stuff, I think. I still have 10 minutes left. I thought there were way more farm uh, shops than this. Is there a shop over... Let me go this way real quick. Redstone is cherry? Yeah, it doesn't... Yeah, but we can... We can battle cherry to... To having the better shop. <laughs> Blue and pink netherwood, yeah, but... We're on 1.15 right now, so can't build a shop for something that doesn't exist. Oh, no, this is the mesa over here. Trident? Well, I mean, doesn't Jevon already have a trident farm? Does Is that the farm that someone said does, doesn't work? Someone's building here, I think. Who is building there? Oh, it's someone that probably lives over this side, I reckon. What does this say? Ah, oh, log sink. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Could have called it. Bounty hunter? Nah. I could buy it, have, buy a plot of land and then sell it later in the season. Nah, I'm not going to worry about that. <laughs> Potions? Potions are a good shout too. Although people just aren't really going to need them that much. They can easily make their own. A mycelium shop? What, what, with, yeah, because it's going to be really difficult to find mycelium at this point, isn't it? Hmm. 
Actually, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hmm. A door salesman? <laughs> I think we're okay with being, being a door salesman. I'm not sure people need doors right now. They can craft their own. Emeralds? Nah. A re a restock your shop shop. <laughs> How does that work? I've just got to restock whatever they've got. A leather goods shop could be interesting, yeah. But what kind of leather goods do people want other than like, well, I guess you'd sell leather actually, probably. Hmm. Yeah, Impulse is next. We're, we're circling the island to see if there's anything new, but uh, I'm like 10 minutes early, so probably we're just going to go back in the portal and get my space for a bit. Um, I thought there were a couple more shops, but I think I must be like misremembering things. <laughs> I swear that was like another shop. Oh, no, I think I'm, yeah. Whatever. Um, A mushroom shop? Hmm... But do people need mushrooms? This is the thing, like, I, wa I want to have one really, really good shop that people are going to use constantly. Actually, saying that, I didn't even look at this shop, did I? I didn't even look at the shops. Oh, this is quartz. Interesting. Interesting. That's with villages, isn't it? Hmm. Hmm. Those beams are um from the end. Another shop, yeah, another another shop in general. Could be interesting. Ooh, someone's caged just in. Rip cub never <laughs> There's a cub more of him. Since when? Oh and I didn't go through the top pool, that's why. Why am I doing this way? We are caged in there, this is weird. A thousand block shop? You can tr you can charge ten diamonds for digging a thousand blocks. Nah, cause someone will get really, really rich from having a shop and then they'll just like order me to dig out their whole base and I've got my own digging plans, so I don't want to be spending all my time digging other people's bases because videos don't see, go super well when you're busy doing that. <laughs> it's no good. No good doing something for someone else when you need to do your own stuff. <laughs> Concrete's great if I didn't need concrete myself. But I need it myself, so... Yep. I trade version 2. I mean, basically, Corralis has got that done. Corralis has got that all sorted, so... Um, do I have this other piece of... Uh, flowers? I still don't have any sunflowers, man. Uh, 100 biddies from Jim. Thank you, Jim. You can trade a bottle of enchanting with clerics, right? You could open a shop that sells shulkers full of bottles of enchanting for a bunch of diamonds so people can repair on the go. I don't know if that would be that helpful. Possible, thank you very much for the 50 biddies as well. Green flammable as well. Uh, 100 biddies. Ace with the 100 biddies. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. I would definitely think about it. I would definitely think about it. Um, did you die boxes? Nah. I'm not, we're not in the stage of the season to be doing that. I don't think. Yeah, I've, I've not seen any sunflowers. I've got these three flowers. But some flowers are literally not... They don't... They literally don't exist right now. XP shop? Nah. People have free XP farms. There's no good making a shop about it. Even I don't like XP shops. I much prefer an XP farm. 
Mm -hmm. I could sell sunflowers, what, a singular sunflower for like a lot of money. <laughs> if I found a sunflower. Maybe we should find a sunflower and try and sell it to people. <laughs> Does anyone have a sunflower on this game right now? Zoom has a sunflower. Okay, well that's not going to work very well then. A pet shop. We've already done pet shops before and stuff like that. Like I say, it's uh, not a very good business. Oh, scaffolding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See? More ideas. I've already written potions and things like that down. I'm writing everything down that I, I think is a potential actual idea that might work. I need to go for diamonds, guys. I look at my, Wait, how many diamonds do I have? Let me have a quick look. Let's put these all in it. Wait, is that two stacks exactly? <gasps> Whoa! Dude, have I got two stacks exactly? I've got two stacks. <laughs> I didn't realise it was two stacks exactly, that's so weird. That's so strange, I didn't really realise that. Two stacks, boom. Um, yeah, so I'm not really that well off. I want to set up a shop before I start spending them. <laughs> Quartz, I mean, uh, Cub already has that sorted, but to be honest, he's quite expensive, so you, you never know. Getting all these things smelted up as well. Build a decoration shop. What would what would be in the decoration shop? Bamboo. Totem of Undying shop. How do you get Totem of Undyings again? My cats are waiting for my creeper farm. That's what they're waiting for. <laughs> so I have a lot of cats. With the skulls. Raids? Oh, villager raids. I've not done a villager raid yet, guys. I've literally not done one. I've literally not done one. I don't know I don't know how the raids go. I wanna breed my cows up again. Um an outpost farm. Oh. Are they dangerous to set up? Or easy well, are they easy? Bank with loans. Unless I was rich, I wouldn't be able to do that, would I? I could breed a jelly cat if I had a jelly cat, but I don't have a jelly cat. Quite dangerous. Okay. Did someone have a totem on dying shop last season? Because I don't remember seeing one. Sell a service? Yeah, well, what's a good service? If I could have a really good product and a really good service shop separately, like that could that could be really good. You know, all round sort of thing. Banners could be good. Then people don't really want the same banner as someone else, you know? So, hmm. Bodyguard service. <laughs> I don't think that would be very good at the bodyguard service. Oh, alphabet banners. Yes. Oh my goodness. Even just for me, because my goodness, I. Yeah. No, that's that's that that's actually a genius idea. What do we make the shop look like though? If it's alphabet banners, what does the what does that shop look like? That's a great idea. I like that. How, but how much do we sell each banner for? That's a great idea. I love that. We build a big giant banner just that, that goes all the way into like the sky <laughs> in the shopping district. No one can, no one can miss it. It's just gonna, just gonna be huge. A giant banner and call it A to Z banners. <laughs> A to Z. ABC shop, ABC letters. I know I've only got two minutes left. Is Impulse online? He is online. Sweet. Uh, we should probably actually, yeah, with two minutes left, I should probably get going. Uh, where do you wanna meet? Another roof? 
Nether roof's a good shout. For um, this reason. Uh, okay, I'll be nether uh, on the nether roof. <laughs> but yeah, massive thank you to all you guys for the support. We are going to be, of course, raiding Impulse. Uh, it is, of course, the Hammercraft stream weekend, which means everyone has a two-hour slot. Uh, what's BRT mean? Um, but yeah, everyone has a two-hour slot, so I'm going to be streaming... Oh, I've streamed for two hours now. Impulse is going to stream for two hours. BRT. What does B... B... Right there. Okay. Sure. I've never... No one's ever used BRT ever before that I've seen. <laughs> it makes sense that, it, that that's what it means, but... Yeah, wh which one is he going to come out of? Oh, I thought it was running closer. That's the cel celebratory stream torch. <laughs> Let's give him the stream stuff. Uh, <laughs> there you go. It's all fine. There you go. Stream torch has been passed. Um, I look like your nan. Do I? Cool. Your nan must be very pretty. Um, right. Um, sweet. That is going to be it for the stream, guys. We're going to be raiding Impulse, so definitely send over your love to him. And I guess I'll catch you guys tomorrow, same p same time, 4pm GMT. Um, yeah, I'll catch you guys all then. Thank you for the support, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.